Oh, it's so heavy. Oh. All right, there he goes again. I'm gonna hit him right here. This is big. What is crack lacking, guys? Welcome back to another episode of Martial Outdoors. Today we are at the lake. Once again, she is nice and frozen. We gained probably four inches in the last couple days. I'm talking cold nights in the single digits, and uh, that'll make ice for you fast. I told you I was coming back for pike redemption. I am here for pike redemption. I got medium suckers. Look, there's a perch in there. Guys, like, you want a big shiner? It's a perch, buddy. They're not even supposed to sell those, but I'll let them go. I'll do something with them. And then uh, three monster decoy minnows, two big rods, two eye fish pros. That is all I'm doing today. Gonna be pike fishing. I might play around some panfish for a little bit if the if the boys are catching them good. But I want to leave here with a teener today. That's right, a teener. I want me a teener today. So we're gonna get out there, get set up. Murray and Brock are on their way once again. We do have another guy coming. Oh, I should say guy and gal. Um, Pig Patrol and his girlfriend are coming too. So if you guys don't know Josh from Pig Patrol, make sure you go check it out. He's like pretty much the ideal angler when it comes to small creeks and rivers. This guy really knows how to whack them. So he uh, decided to drive up to Murray's last night and uh, see if he could get on some ice. So. We're on ice. They're all gonna come out here. We're gonna cook a bunch of food, put a bunch of tip-ups out, catch a bunch of panfish. It's gonna be a freaking riot. So you guys make sure you stay tuned. And uh, let's go get us one of those teeners. Yeah, stay tuned. Yeah, I drilled a couple in there. Yeah, I'm gonna put, what? I'm gonna put one of my tip-ups in this far one right here and then I'm gonna, I'll drill one even further out there. Put one out there. Get it, girl. All right, we're all just getting set up. Like I said before, I'm gonna do some pike fishing for a little while. See if the pikes are biting. If the guys are pounding on panfish really good, then I'll probably jump in on that, but. Got a bunch of sucker minnows and I'm looking to burn them up. Brock went across the lake. Pretty sure he's already on them. Get the Vexlar ripping. Check the depth. It's 13 feet. Probably put this thing four feet off bottom. Four or five feet off bottom because they'll definitely come up and get it. This big pike ain't scared. Yeah, right there. All right, let's go grab the monster minnow. Get her minnow. One in the back. One in the snoot, since these pike always grab them in the nose. Just like so, big baits. Looking for big pike today, so. Get it going. Oh yeah. Anyways. Swimming perfect. When you're running big minnows for big pike, usually I set the iFish Pro on the lightest setting for when I'm fishing walleyes. Today, crank that thing all the way to the back. We uh, definitely want her tight. Bail's open, it's a little bit tight, so good to go. Let it rip. I'm gonna set my uh, second eye fish pro. And then I'm probably gonna get some food ready. Boys and food. The boys and Ashley have been uh, catching some panfish, so that's good. I'll probably do that after lunch or something. But for now, I'm gonna set a couple tip ups, grip it and rip it, and uh, probably get food ready. Really hoping on some pike today. I'm gonna go with smaller sucker minnows with these, with this one, and uh, one single hook. And once again, even though it's not a giant minnow, but lock her all the way down. Bail's open. Mine's already spooling in the wind, which is just great. There we go. Like to have the line blowing back on it a little bit. Keep her doing. 
keep her tuned. Yes. I don't know, it's going that way. Oh, uh, there you go. Yeah, I hope it's not the middle. Yeah, I want to hit him on the run like that too. I'm gonna make a move first. Dude, the minnow is like half the size of him. Was that your bait? Got bigger on the sweetest minnow. Pretty much. <laughs> yeah, not happy about that. Not happy about that. Oh. How many suckers we got? A lot. A lot. He just stayed latched. Someone ripped on me about the oh wow, yeah, he latched. <laughs> there we go. He gone. Alright. I've been at this wrapping bacon you know me i'm going fishing we're eating good so just got uh done that's four packs of bacon a bunch of deer whole jar of jalapenos it's about to go down i'm gonna go outside and fire up the grill and uh we'll be eating soon we are going live oh my you know, and they sizzle. Woo! Here we go. One full rack on. We got another one to go. It's gonna be a long road. We're already smoked out. Four portable is gonna be just greasing. Turn this sucker down. She is gripping and ripping today. Full rip mode. Oh, oh. Just smell that coming out. Just, it's just coming out like a smokehouse in there. Yeah, I'm gonna cook so I can get to fishing. Oh, here comes the swans. Oh, Murray's on. Oh my gosh. Throw that thing on the barbecue. It's already hot. It's already hot, man. Let me get in on this. Big, big, big. What? Big. Monster. Oh, oh my yeah. God. Yeah. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about, buddy. Let's get back down there. There's more. Do I even have a wax worm on there? It's not looking good. Okay, Sending right. them home. That's, yeah, go ahead. Dude. Man. First crappie of the day for me. Sounds like it's burning down. Does it? Yeah, dude. Does not sound good. I hear a lot of popping in there. Holy cat. Well, sounds like Ashley just cut. An absolute dandy of a bite on the tip up. I uh, can couldn't go and get it at the moment, as you can tell. That's all right. Just as happy to see someone else catch it. But uh, we're almost uh, second batch done. Ripping and gripping here. The evening bite's gonna get really greasy, I think. Cloud cover just came in. Usually when those pikes start moving around, but we're gonna see some more fish. That's for sure. But. Uh, for now, let's get these bathers done and get the fishing. What? Round two, boys. Mmm. <laughs> Just as hot. Yeah, no one. We'll get it good. It's crooked. Oh, it's so heavy. Oh, it's so heavy, dude. Buddy, buddy, He's buddy. ripping. He's ripping. He is ripping. Yeah. This is gonna be good, all right? Oh, he's ripping, dude. And it does feel kind of heavy, doesn't it? Yeah, I pulled on and it felt pretty heavy. Yeah. Just stopped. 
All right, there he goes again. I'm gonna hit him right here. I'm gonna pull her tight. I'm gonna pull it tight, bud. This is big. This is big. Is it big? Yep. Nice. This is big. Here's your slip. Oh, dude, this is big. This might be good. I don't think it's. I don't think it's like crazy, but. I don't know. Booze wasn't doing that. I think it's big. Booze wasn't pulling line out. You're gonna have to get that knot, I'm sure. Like off the ice? Yeah, I'm sure it's clipped. Good. All right, we're gonna see him right here. I don't think it's gonna be big. What's the definition of big? It's no. crazy. And the treble hooks, one treble hook's going crazy, so I'm gonna take my time here. Yeah, you might hook the ice a little bit. It's about the same size though, isn't it? Yeah, it looks the same size. Yeah. It's like a tad it's like bigger. Rocky, huh? Rocky, you better get your tip up. Yeah, he's decent. Yeah, he ain't bad. There you go. There you go. I'll take yeah. that. What's he got a lamp ring there? Let me get him. Here, you want to get him? He's it. fat. Grab that. Send him home. Send him home. Send him home. You want a picture of that beauty? Not bad, but not good. You sure? No, no, send him home. Let's go check the other one. What? Oh my god! <laughs> the bale's closed. <laughs> I didn't oh set my this one god. I see the rod bent over at one point. Oh yeah, she definitely popped off. <laughs> I see the rod tacoed at one point. <laughs> yeah, I swear. Oh, that's awesome. Good job, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Oh man, these minnows are pathetic. These are like crappy minnows. All right, we got a new minnow. Not, uh, definitely not the desired size of minnow I would go with for a quick strike rig, but it's pretty much all we got to work with. So we're just gonna put them in. Hope that the pikes don't care. All right. Not the ideal minnow, but uh, I think he'll do. Josh just had another flag pop up, so we're gonna go get to that. The flags have been popping, which is really nice. Finally got some cloud cover. Clear ice, thin ice. These pike like cloud cover for feeding time. And uh, I'm guessing it's feeding time, because they are ripping. All right, that one's set, ready to go. heavy Does it? yeah but it feels like it's just literally it's yeah it's literally just coming in or something maybe i'm just whacking him like a dag okay. he is, is he? on there are you serious yeah he is on there sitting right under the hole no he's just holding on to it the whole time he doesn't even got it in his mouth it's not that big yeah he's literally got a t-bone but he won't let go you seen him yeah watch pull him right up he's not even hooked let's go slow Come I see is I see the color. Come popping right in. Oh, he's pulling back. He might have just kicked it loose there. Like took it? Yeah. Oh. No, he's oh. Still got it, didn't. Yeah, he still got it. How big would you say he is? I don't know. I'm just gonna rip his lips off quick. <laughs> <laughs> got him. Definitely got him. It's a giant. Yeah, dude, he literally had it T-boned. And he just, it was like, just yeah, dude, just walked him like a dog right to the hole. <laughs> there he goes. There he goes. <laughs> see, you see you later. Well, wow, look at how speckled he is, huh? Pretty. On the tip up. Yeah. He got the one earlier. He's a freckled up guy. Yeah, he's got some fleas. See you later, dude. came soaring after it. Like 
soaring. Look at you can see there. him fighting yeah. on the panoptics. That is so cool. awesome. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. I love those things. If he doesn't break off, I'll be shocked. I'll get in there and grab him for you. Oh wow, great right oh, in the snoot. I wanted a pike. <laughs> I caught a pike. Right, I guess I haven't yet, but. Great right in the nose too. Wow. Like a snot rocket. He is a snot rocket. <laughs> you should have seen, he came yeah, out of nowhere. He came from like 10 feet to the side and just like. And missed it the first time. And then I just like froze and panicked. Alrighty, alrighty. I think we're gonna call it a day. The boys are actually chasing the last flag. As you guys can see, it is uh, the sun has set. Just wrapped the house up. Good day, fun day, fun day. Out uh, pounding some fish. I was going for big pike, and that just didn't seem to happen. So, whatever. They're hooked up. Looking good. Looking cool. So, make sure you guys go check out Mary's channel. Check out Josh, the Pig Patrol's channel, and uh, Brocky B Rock. So, we'll probably be back at it a couple more times this week. Trying to chase something, I'm not sure. Probably more pan fish, maybe some big bite too. But uh, yeah, we got uh, some nice pan fish, some nice crappies, and a couple decent pikes. So cool to have those guys up from Nebraska on ice for their first time of the season. So make sure you guys check his channel out. He's an awesome dude. But uh, I gotta haul this to the truck and then come back out, get another load. So let's get the move on. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. Make sure you guys drop down. Hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, and we will see you next time.